All right, it's my last day of this dry fasting journey. I break my fast one day earlier because this morning I just feel very dizzy and and I still couldn't poop. So my stomach is saying that yeah, I really need to get rid of those things, and I don't have my enema here. Otherwise, I I can do the enema to get rid of. <coughs> whatever toxins is inside my gut, um, but then now I really need to use water to flush them out. So I break my fast this morning, and that's also shows that yeah, you don't need to fix any certain date of your dry fast. You can, according to your feeling, according to your body is telling you messages,、um, whatever you feel like, you can. You can break it、um, in a、uh, really really soft way. So today I'm going to show you、um, what I、uh, ate this today to help me to、um, break the fast. So it's very simple. I have、uh, sodium bicarbonate, magnesium chloride. Um, Himalayan salt and spirulina. So all of these are、uh, replenishing my body's electrolyte. So before going to eat anything, yes, water you can drink, but is、um, but remember replenish your electrolyte first. So I drink,、uh, mix them all, and drink.、Uh, A few glass to replenish my body. You can drink tea also from、uh, herbs or from spices. That's very good for warming. And then there are some rules that you can you need to follow. Otherwise, your your body will feel very bad after the fast. So the first day,、uh, stick to a liquid food diet. So don't eat any solid food. Until the second day, but also the solid foods should be very soft, like avocado or eggs or、uh, spinach, and for your body to digest easily. And no carbohydrates until day four. So、um, no sweet things, no fruits, no root vegetables. Because you don't want your、um, insulin level to spike up that quick, that will、um, disturb the stem cell which、um, was released in day four or five. To <coughs> because they are still going because they are still dividing, they are still、um, doing the rejuvenation part. If your insulin level suddenly go up, then the BKA will go up, and then your stem cell will turn into fat cell, which you don't want. So you you really want your stem cell to replenish your damaged body part instead of turning into fat cells. So don't waste the whole period of dry fast.、Um, so you better. We we had to really really be careful of what we eat after the fast,、um, and then eat some probiotics.、Uh, can be in pills, can be in yogurt form, and remember, do not overeat or do not overdrink because our gut、uh, shrink after the fast. So don't stress your gut that quick. So be gentle. And you might have diarrhea. That's super normal. You might have stomach pain, which is also normal. And the diarrhea, like me today, all it all I went to toilet like ten times, which is good that I can finally flush out all the waste products that was accumulated during the dry fast. And yeah, the color was like deep red. Um, brown, orange, color. So yeah, that's super normal. And 
yeah that's the these some basic rules and spirulina is really really good just a reminder that it has uh, tryptophan which um, can supply the genetic signals of the dna to reproduce more so yeah take spirulina and all the other electrolytes that's very good for your body to restart eating again so yeah i have a really really nice journey this time and and thank you for your attention for your support and if you have any questions about dry fast let me know and i'm going to i will do my best to to answer your questions all right have a lovely day and night thank you